Sup guys, Hey King here, bringing you another live reaction to the E3 2019 conferences. So, I, I kind of, I just went to bed last night, I couldn't be bothered to watch the Square Inx conference. Because I had a feeling it was going to suck, and apparently it, it did. It, it sucked. Uh, people were left disappointed a lot by what they revealed. Uh, which was, you know, mainly they wanted to see that Avengers game. But apparently that did not live up to the hype. Which I knew was going to be the case. Well, I want to see the Final Fantasy one first because that's all I care about. Then I'll watch the uh, Avengers one. Let's see how that goes. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, no, where's the one for today? There we go. Four minutes. Interesting. And apparently. It's part one. We don't know how many episodes it's going to be, but they're releasing this as a full game, uh, which is just the Midgard section, but it's going to be expanded upon. So let's see how good it looks. Starting in three, two, one, and here we go. Oh, the music. Arif. Loveless. Look at that scale, man. Shinra Tower. These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. Oh, you can do a bike chase. That's new. That's awesome. You can have it. Oh, for please. saving my life. You think he's a keeper? Oh my god. <laughs> Wedge. Got it. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Help me! <laughs> what is that stuff? Oh. Nerf gameplay heal. Tiva! Marlene! Marlene! <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Cloud drinking, that's new. He's got I the material in his sword. Thoughts. You can see the holes. That's cool. We have to think big if we're going to make a difference. He's got like metal I plates on like her this. gloves, that's awesome. I just... I feel trapped. My turn. Sewer monsters? Get going. That's awesome. Tag team. Oh, Shinra building, all sides of bike. Oh, what is that? Oh, right. Uh, I've been for seven in years, so I have no clue with the monsters, right? Like. Got you now. Huh? I think I remember that one. Zephyr You're not real. You're. Cloud, I have a favor to ask of you. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Yeah! Hold on to that hatred. That's cool. That's cool. Let's go some fun off the fun. Oh, I already knew, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm getting that still book. 
I am getting that steel book. I might order it now. Oh. Alright, this is the figure you get if you get the collectors or whatever. No, I'm not getting that. That looks like crap. <laughs> I, prefer, I prefer the one from uh, Advent Children. That bike was dope. Um, that was a cool trailer, man. Uh, I can't wait to play this game now. Uh, but the biggest question is, is going to be how many years do we have to wait for the next parts? So this is going to be the entirety of Midgard. It's going to be expanded upon. It's going to be a full game. So instead of looking at like 5 to 10 hours, because when you play the original game and you take your time with it and you're exploring and you're doing everything, it does take a long while before you exit. Like, it, it ain't such a short part, unless you're doing a speed run, which I've never done, okay? I've only played that game once and that's it. But I just remember when I first played that game, I just remember thinking, wow, this is like a, I wonder where this is going, it's like a big sea, and then you end up coming out of it, you end up exiting Midgard, and then the whole world opens up to you, and I, and I was just like, holy crap, like, the, the game is just beginning, like, that, that was just like a whole entire prologue section, and the game is now just beginning, so it was crazy for me to play it back in the day, like, I only played it, what, yeah, I played it in 2009, I think, like, 10 years ago, um, so it was crazy for me at the time, playing that, and then the world just like, so, so instead of this being this like 10 hour, because I imagine uh, if uh, the original, again, if you play the original and take your time, it's, it's 10 hours long, isn't it? This would have to be like, what, 20 to 30 hours long, perhaps, maybe? Like, if they're going to expand on it, if they're going to expand on the entirety of Midgard, if you're able to explore all of Midgard. So, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know how you have, like the different sections. So, maybe we get to explore all the different sections, because that's the only way I can see them extending this game and you doing different things with the story and that, and you developing a relationship with all these characters that are going to end up uh, perishing, like, you know, you're going to have to develop your relationship with Jesse, with Biggs and Wedge, more stuff there with uh, with uh, Arif, Atifa and that, and the villains, of course, and the Turks, they haven't even been shown yet, but we know they're going to end up here towards, like, the end of, or end of that entire section, so it's going to be very interesting to see what they do, how they do it, and that, etc, etc, if you will, um, be... Yeah, I'm just I'm just curious how this is gonna work, but I'm more curious like how many years we're gonna have to wait for the next part. Because if we get part two, right? How how long would part two be? Like, what would that uh, compromise that of? Like, and honestly, the only thing I can think of is 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 maybe part two would lead all the way up to a character's certain death. Like that would be the end of part two, and then part three. I'm trying to remember like what part. I'm trying to remember how the game would go because part three. You end up going all the way to the northern crater, and then that's when you discover the truth about Sephiroth, and then the monsters are awakened. And you get that whole thing with Cloud, like, sort of just going into... So, may so maybe, maybe they'll change it up. Maybe, maybe it'll end with that entire reveal. Instead of the death, it'll end with that reveal instead. And then part, and then they'll release part, so it'll be, end up being a trilogy, and then part three would end up being everything to do with, uh, you uh, playing as another, as another main character, as playing, uh, playing Sid, basically, playing a Sid while Cloud is lost or recovering, and you're doing all the stuff with the, with the, uh, weapons, and then that entire final with Shinra and that, and get into, so, I don't know, maybe, maybe that's how they'll do it, though, I feel like that would be a, then again, because you return to Midgard towards the end of the game, maybe they'll extend that as well and make an entire something to do with that. So I'm curious. I'm, again, I'm curious how this is going to work because I'm so confused how they're going to end up doing this, how they're not going to do, how they're going to do a lot of this out, like, uh, especially with the characters that you have to find, like, because, you know, you, in, in the original you can miss two of the characters, which are uh, Vincent and Yuffie, so how are they going to do that? Are they going to be part of the main story that you end up, finding them regardless, or is this going to be another case where you have to explore and do certain things to get those characters, and Wuto as well, how is that going to fit, because there's all these big places they can expand upon, so, guys, man, guys, I'm just like, I'm a bit concerned, because while this looks amazing, and it does, I'm so concerned what the future holds for the rest of, 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 of the game, like, because it's, it, it, when they first said they were going to release an episodic, it was very worrying, and it is still worrying, because you, you have to wonder, how many years do we have to wait for each entry in the game, like, because if it's like every two to three years, that's a decade we're going to be waiting just to get this entire game, and by then, uh, the next gen consoles will be out, so what does that entail, like, we have to... We have to get the next gen consoles to play the rest of the games, or because they said this is a PS4 exclusive when it was first announced. So are we still getting this on PS4? Like, like what's going on? Like, <laughs> um, 
I'm just very worried, but excited at the same time. Uh, but I'm just hoping the future for it looks good. Anyway, guys, that's my reaction to that. As always, like and subscribe wherever, and I shall see you when I shall see you. Take care. Bye.